Hello, hello, hello. How's everyone doing? Welcome back to another episode here on Destiny's Tarot. So today's reading is going to be for Virgo. Sun, moon, rising, Venus placements, north node. Thank you all so much for the love and support. Please remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'm taking this time to just clear the energy and the room and over my cards. I hope you guys are doing fine, Virgo. <clears throat> All right, so we're going to be starting off with the sex positive deck. This is what we've been using lately. To start the readings. Let's get some paper Just for Virgos, what do we have here? I don't know why I just said that. <laughs> What's the message for the Virgos? Activism. We have prevention and menstruation. We have BDSM at the bottom of the deck, and we also have ass in the reverse. So I don't feel like you're gay or you're dealing with somebody gay, Virgo, or none of that. Especially with menstruation and prevention here, okay? All right, I feel like you're going to be finding out something that shocks you, Virgo, okay? With this activism here, this is like, maybe you're coming to back to a realization about something or you're just shocked about something or something is going to be like shocking to find out. This can have something to do with a birth or pregnancy, Okay. I feel like you use the condom with whoever it is energy I'm picking up on. And maybe you're going to be shocked to find out that someone got their menstruation, had an abortion, or had a miscarriage of some sort. We have, I lost myself for a while. So um, you could have been finding yourself doing things with someone that you wouldn't do, you know, and you're realizing now that you lost yourself. In that situation. So we're going to take that for activism. Okay, if I menstruation. It was my fault, but I blamed you. And prevention. Okay. Not prevention here. Okay. I want to be more than friends. So, Virgo, you could be sleeping with someone and you're using a condom with this person, but this person wants to be more than friends. So, maybe they want to, like, not use a condom anymore okay? because there's a hand that is also, like, catching the semen that's coming out of this condom. So, <clears throat> maybe someone is wanting to go the extra mile or, you know, to the next level with you and not use condom anymore. I lost myself for a while with activism. Lied about a pregnancy. Okay, this is clarifying activism, and I lost myself for a while. So like I said, you could be finding out that, I mean, and lied about a pregnancy with I lost myself for a while. You could be finding out that this person lied to you about a pregnancy. This could be very shocking to you. Maybe you feel like this person would never do something like this. You could be dealing with a Pisces. Um, make sure you go check out Pisces reading if that's the case. It'll be posted before Virgo, okay? Justice. So, this person definitely could have had some type of um, 25 at the bottom of the deck. You or this person, Virgo, a plot of rose, how they fit, take and resonate, leave what doesn't. But somebody here could have definitely had like a um, um, an abortion or a miscarriage. And they blamed you for it. But really, they know it was their fault with justice. Somebody knows that they're going through karma. Somebody knows that, um, that they're under judgment for, for whatever they did. Okay. Prevention, and I want to be more than friends. Can I find this? Prevention, I want to be more than friends. 
Yeah, we have not the father and we have miscarriage. So prevention with prevention, like I said, I feel like you use the condom with this person. And this person, you know, they probably, or maybe you did take the condom off, okay? For some of you, you could have used the condom with this person and it's like, you know, for a fact that you were not the father of this child. For some of you, you could have definitely took the condom off, but you probably still didn't, like, ejaculate into this person, all right? This person wants to be more than friends, but it could have been divinely guided for them to have this miscarriage. They could have been trying to trap you or you were trying to trap someone here, Virgo, so we're going to jump into this tarot. To clarify this, we have the sun. Somebody here could be pregnant as well. They're going to have a son or this baby would have been a, a little boy. I feel like someone here is ulti finding ultimate happiness or um, trying to find that. You could also be dealing with a Leo. Clarify a lot about a pregnancy. Activism and lessons from Virgo. Virgo. You could have also been looking at this person like they were your happiness, Virgo. And then it's, it's like it's shocking to find out that they would have, you know, lied about a pregnancy or lied about having a miscarriage. You know, just to all you finding out that you're just not the father of this child. Why is activism here? I lost myself for a while and lied about a pregnancy. We have two of cups reverse. So you could have given up on a marriage or some type of other commitment that you were in with the Scorpio. Or like I said, it could have just ended because you got this person pregnant or you thought this person was pregnant or you thought you were the father of their child. Clarify menstruation. It was my fault, but I've been truly justified. Yeah, I definitely feel like with this King of Swords, like I said before, the King of Swords can represent like God, angels, um, or angels. It can represent someone of authority, the the hospitals, doctors, police officers, judge, all of that. So um, this person, it was my fault, but I blamed you. Somebody here could definitely have went to the hospital with menstruation because they could have been bleeding. Um, I feel like this person is a liar, okay? And I feel like they are a gossiper as well, too. But whatever this person said about blood, they lied, okay? Um, I feel like they, they could have done did this because of a Queen of Cups energy, a mother energy, somebody else that you're dating or was dating or had some type of contact with with the Ace of Swords. That's, this is giving someone a lot of clarity, um, I'm on track. I, I, I honestly feel like this is why this person did this. This person's mother and father could have also, with this king of swords up, I could also told this person you need to tell the truth about this situation as well, too. Clarify prevention. I want to be more than this is and not the father. Somebody here could be also trying to convince you to tell someone else or to cause someone else to have a miscarriage and you're not the father. With this activism, it's like someone could be literally trying to mind, like change your mind, like view it this way, see it this way, like type energy, okay? Or like hoping and praying on that, that someone's child doesn't make it into this world, all right? So we have for prevention, I want to be more than friends, miscarriage and not the father. We have six of wands in the reverse. I feel like this person had a fall from grace in your book, Virgo. I feel like you took them off of some type of pedestal you had them on. Like I said, this could be a Pisces. This person could be in the energy of trying to come up with different ideas to get you to stop being so guarded with the seven of wands. I feel like you're back to protecting yourself from this person. I feel like you don't trust this person at all, Virgo. Or they don't feel they don't feel that way about you. I feel like something took a nasty turn with the will of fortune in the reverse. The table definitely turned on this situation and this person. 
Yeah, but I definitely feel like with this sperm and all being all over this card, I feel like someone definitely had some type of DNA test as well, too. Clarify this um, two of cups in reverse with prevention with death. Four of Pentacles, yeah. I feel like even though um, Virgo, this could be you or this other person, I feel like even though something is over or it ended, you're still holding on to that person. Maybe you want to reconcile with this person. I feel like you're, you're, you're over here like, damn, I lost my person because I thought I got somebody pregnant. So you could be feeling real like down and out right now. And the fact that you even stepped into this nine of wands energy being very, you know, promiscuous, sexual, having sex with this one and that one, not using condoms. I feel like secrets are definitely coming out about this situation. Could be a Pisces you were involved with. A lot of secrets could be coming out. Clarify the King of Swords up or an Ace of Swords with the Queen of Cups. Yeah, somebody could have had you all like, somebody could have you or had you mentally like messed up about this situation. Like, because you lost a lot. You could have lost family members not talking to you or you lost your family. Uh, you could have lost your home, Virgo, um, Nine of Pentacles, Reverse. You could have lost a job or lost money behind this person's lies. I feel like that's why you are walking away, like running away from this person as well. You do need to know that justice is going, going to go in your favor, okay? You're going to get the karma that you deserve. You're going to get dharma instead of, um, and this person is going to get karma for what they did to you. Yeah, this person you can't, you couldn't trust. You didn't even know that this was somebody that was very loose with their sexual energy. This was a whore, a hoe however you want to put it like i said this person could have also lost a job somebody here lost money and a job behind this queen of wands in the reverse someone that's codependent as well too king of wands reverse king of pentacles upright yeah queen of pentacles upright your mother and father could have told you that this person was this way and you didn't listen to them this person had you you know maybe had you doing things that you wouldn't normally do in, in secret I feel like you didn't know that this person was also someone that is very hateful, envious, jealous, low vibrational. You probably didn't know that about this person. I feel like the chariot came, Virgo, and you got on that bitch and you had, you like took off. That's the truth. Seven of swords in reverse. When you seen that chariot, when you found out that you were not the father, when you found out this person could have had a miscarriage or whatever the hell they lied about here involving blood, like you took off. You could have even found out that this person was on their period. Like Ace of Wands reverse. Their plan didn't work because you found out that they was on their period. You could have found out this person was trying to control you. Yeah, Seven of Swords reverse. That's the truth. They lied here. This third party lied. Okay? They could have presented themselves like they are this Empress energy. And they're not. They're just the Queen of Wands in reverse. A little liar and a little hoe. Not a Wands upright with the five cups of cups. So I got three classes here. Or this is you. Yeah, I feel like you lost your family because you gave this person this ace of cups. You made love to this person. You you were emotional with this person. You put you had them on a pedestal, okay? You you were trying to balance things out with this person, have a life with them. And you threw away something with somebody else for this person, and they just lied about a pregnancy. This person could have did this for negative connotations. They didn't even have a real reason, reason to do what they did, you know? Could be an Aries. I do feel like this tower has backfired onto this person. They're in the Seven of Pentacles reverse. They're feeling down, lazy, unambitious, you know? Why is the eight of pentacles? Eight of cups. Right here. Oh, there we go. Eight of cups. Okay. 
strength in reverse with the ace of wands reverse so yeah when i feel like this person was confident virgo that this plan was gonna work okay they they they, they thought that they had this in the bag nine of pentacles in reverse this bitch don't even take good care of herself nothing is nurturing about her okay virgo could be a Vir uh, virgo taurus capricorn with this nine of pentacles energy Ace of Wands upright, Nine of Pentacles reverse. But this person thought they had got away with, with lying to you about this pregnancy, about this miscarriage, about blood. This person could have gotten their period as well, too. They could have blamed you for whatever the hell it was they was going through or was feeling and thought that they could get this type of justice from you and it didn't work. Yeah, they thought they could continue to manipulate and work this magic. It could be an Aquarius that did this as well, too. Oh, this person has Aquarius in their chart. They're under judgment, okay, for what they did. This person could have did this because they didn't want you to have any peace, okay? Or they, they didn't want the person that you chose over them to have any peace. Something here about someone else being at peace. Why is the Seven of Swords here with the Five of Wands in reverse? They could have been trying to steal your joy, steal your peace, steal your happiness from you. Seven of Swords, upright with five of Wands in reverse. Clear messages, please. Yeah, we have the lovers. They they knew you you and your person were soulmates. They knew you and this person was meant to be, meant to, to be together, divinely brought together. The lovers upright. Mm -hmm. And they could have lied up about a lot. This person could have lied about a lot and had you all confused as to who your soulmate was, who you were supposed to be with, who you were supposed to choose when they did this magic i feel like you just want to walk away from this person virgo or this person just want to walk away from you and go to karma waters wherever karma waters is okay wherever like somebody is being seen as the liar that they are six of swords upright and gossiper that they are this could be your sister or a meddling parent with the queen of swords and reverse i feel like somebody is losing their shit because you have completely walked away from them you're done with them they lied. They could have blamed you for some shit, Virgo. Nine of Swords upright. Yeah. You were the emperor in the reverse. You lost control of a situation. You got manipulated. You lost control of yourself. You were in this two of swords. You didn't know who to choose. Because they confused you with this manipulation and magic that they did. Two of swords with the emperor in the reverse. Yeah, now this person is somewhere stalking and watching you. You could have felt like, you know, getting involved with this person. You could feel like I, I did I should have never did this. Two of swords upright. I should have never gotten involved with this type of person. You could be in regret. Yeah, I should have never had sex with this person. Nine of Wands. Yep. This person is someone that is false. High priestess reverse. This person don't even have no intuition. Okay, this was unhealthy attachments. This could be like um, friends, family members, a third party situation. I feel like you want growth now with the devil here in the reverse. You don't want to feel stuck, trapped and bound no more like this person had you feeling confused, stuck. Yeah. Can I find the moon upright? Yeah, the five of swords. And the pinnacles are placed here. This could have been someone that was supposed to be mature because of their age. Or they just could be like in this older energy. <laughs> but with the Three of Pentacles up, I feel like they want to collaborate with you because they feel like you make them happy. They feel like they found ultimate happiness with you. That's why they want to be more than friends. That's why they want you to take off the condom or that's why they wanted you to take off the condom. Somebody feels like you're their happiness like you guys um are supposed to have children together because you know the son can represent a son a daughter children as well too if only they can get you to collaborate back with them but the ten of swords is here this is over with okay this person caused a lot of blockages and delays setbacks they tried to stand in the way of who you are supposed to be with that's why this ten of swords is two of wands Temperance in the reverse. This person is somewhere just 
unbalanced, unhealed. They don't have any patience, moderation. They don't have nothing about them. All they're doing is stressing you out as well, too. I don't feel like you want to deal with this person. I don't feel like you want to be more than friends with this person. Temperance in the reverse. Ten of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, this person feels, this person is being stubborn, okay? And they could possibly feel like they, they, they deserve this life with you or they deserve to have you. They're going to come in, Virgo, with some type of sexual offer towards you because they're stubborn, okay? Page of, they're being warned, okay, by the divine. If you're this third party, look, I can't make this up. You're being warned to move on and leave this person alone. A cycle has closed out. The world card is here. This cycle that you were in with this person is over. You're being warned, not by me, not by this person, but by the divine God. Okay? You feeling an unrequited love because of what you did. Clarify the page of cups reverse with the nine of cups upright spirit. Your stability is protected, Virgo. Okay? Page of Cups reverse and the Nine of Cups upright. You have the Nine of Cups. Somebody could want to come in towards you and give you an apology or give you an offer of love or go towards somebody else, however this go. But this person, they're stubborn. They don't want to leave you alone. Or you don't want to leave this person alone. So you're going to keep coming in with your naked body or, or being flirtatious or being promiscuous towards somebody that you know is trying to go towards someone else. The chariot is here for this person, okay? Cancer energy is here as well, too, with the chariot. What about a knot of cups upright? Yep, the chariot. This person has taken this chariot, and they are on their way to someone else, and you feel unrequited love. That's your fault. Like I said, you're being warned. You can argue, fight, gossip all you want, but you're being warned to carry on with your life. If this is you or this person. Okay, somebody is being divinely guided to go elsewhere. They were, they were brought this chariot, they took it, and now they're going elsewhere to go give their love offer or to give their cup of love. Okay, this person's not even looking back. They're just moving forward. Okay, if I do a um, lot of cups up, I'll get the chariot. Yeah, you're the, the hermit in the reverse with the empress in the reverse. Four of Cups refers to, like, somebody here does not know how to just go about their business. Like, this person, whoever this is, is the, um, could have lied about a pregnancy with the Empress in the reverse. Okay, that's why this masculine has no problem. Somebody here could, um, could be coming off as someone that's very codependent, that doesn't like to be by themselves. They're trying to stay, you, you, you can try to stay in communication with this person all you want. They're still leaving you behind. So, I mean... Or you're going to still leave this person behind, Virgo. So, yeah. If I the three of cups up, I go on yours. This person could be sexually frustrated as well, too. Yeah, this, is, this was an injustice. For this person to be celebrating with this third party, to these, these, this unhealthy attachment. And somebody, you could be have this unhealthy attachment, Virgo. To this person or you have someone that is attached to you and it's unhealthy. All they want to do, do is drink and party and have sex. That's all this third party want to do. This is an injustice. They not This person is not supposed to be doing this with you. This person could be married. They were in some immature energy. Okay. They were committing adultery. They were giving to you and breadcrumbing someone else. And this is not what they were supposed to be doing. They could have also um, made the decision to do this. Like I said, this could have happened in the past with the six of cup energy, but it still was, it still was an injustice. It's something that wasn't supposed to be done. So when you went and did this manipulation or, or this little spell or, you know, put, put it on this person, got them all pissed pussy whipping, don't know who to choose. That was wrong. This is, this person belongs to somebody else. This is somebody's husband or boyfriend. Like this person did not belong to you, Virgo, or they do not belong to you. Seven of Pentacles reverse. Eight of Pentacles up with the Nine of Wands. You, somebody here is working their hardest to have communication or keep communication. All right. 
You could be doing this too as a Sagittarius Virgo as well too. I feel like this person really, they're not really interested. They're very guarded. They don't really feel like they can trust you anymore. Nine of Wands upright. But you're, you're definitely putting in the work to, to gain someone's trust and the cycle is over. A cycle is over. I feel like this, this third party also wants to like come in and speak some truth or, or, or say something really quick to keep a cycle from closing out as well too. And it's done because this person is frustrated or they're feeling sexually frustrated. Yeah, it's done. This is over with. What's the outcome for Virgo? What else we need to know? What's the outcome for this situation? Spirit God. Ace of Pentacles. There's a new beginning here. There's a new beginning here. Someone is definitely contemplating this situation, thinking about it. Clarify the Ace of Pentacles. There's a new beginning here. There's a fresh start. Yeah. Four swords upright. I feel like um, this could be this third party trying to get this masculine to go back in the energy of considering being with them because they want to be more than friends. But there's definitely a new beginning. There's definitely that something that this masculine is, is thinking about. Four swords upright. Yeah, page of swords. I feel like this third party is arguing and fighting and, and gossiping about someone else that's in this person's life or has this person's interest. And they're trying to, they want that person to feel rejected by this person. They want this person to feel, to lose a home, to feel ghosted by this Virgo or Virgo, this is you. A pile of rose, how they fit. But I, I just feel like this is not going to work. I just feel like this is not going to work. Somebody could be bringing up the past a lot. And I feel like this is not going to work because of a marriage, because of some commitment. But they want this person to reconsider. They really do. This third party wants this person to really think about it. So we have the letter D here. We have Leo. I don't know. This masculine or feminine, they could definitely be in the energy of, of thinking about it, trying to reconsider it. Because this is someone that is coming off as the hermit in the reverse. They're being very codependent. They, they're, it's like they can't, they can't not talk to somebody. They can't not, they can't be by themselves. They don't like their own company. But they're a false person. And they and it's like, you, you already see this person as a false person. Or this person already sees you as a false person. As someone that is a liar. Someone that lied about being pregnant. We have Gemini, number 40, significant two. And we have Divine Feminine. I also feel like this is somebody that does not mind being juggled. They don't mind being the side piece. They just want to be in the picture. So that another can get breadcrumb. So that they can say that they are sleeping with someone's husband. Like this is just nasty. You're not the father. 11-11, Divinely Guided, Sexual Attraction. You were, this was supposed to happen. You got to learn the lessons that you need to learn from this Virgo or this person, whoever you are, you need to learn the lessons you need to learn from this. This divinely happened. You're not the father for a reason. So awaken, wake up with this activism. Wake up and smell the coffee. Sexual attraction, that's all that it was. That's all it'll ever be. Look at how this person is trying to step to you with sexual energy. This is a whole. Libra could be involved. This divine feminine could be a Libra. I have Libra in their chart. We have Cancer. What else is here for Virgo's energy? What's the message? 25. Compulsive Liar is here. We have Scorpio. Spiritual Protection. Drugs and alcohol could have been involved. Pisces, Sagittarius, Twin Flame, 29, Sex Addiction, 38, and 7. So someone knows that someone else has a sex addiction, which is why they probably try to have this person all tied up with this incarcerated at the bottom of the deck. 
you know, you don't have to be in jail, but like mentally just like all tied up because, and so they, they knew your weakness and they used you. This person could be 38 years old. This situation could have happened in July of 2022. Yeah. So this is not somebody that you can trust, Virgo, or you're not trustworthy. You're a hoe. All right. So let's continue here. I'm going to pull some time frame Oracle messages for you guys before I close out the reading. The messages for Virgo before the end of the year. What does your intuition feel the time frame is? That is the answer. It's better to give this more time to come in. All right, so make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications. And thank you all so much for even taking the time out to view the reading. Take good care of yourselves. Until next time.